What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another Shiny Shuriken stream. We are live again today. How's everybody doing? Uh, I'm super excited because today we're going to be opening some Pokemon cards before we get into our shiny hunting. So, as you can see, we've got it all set up. Uh, so, I'm super excited because this is the new set. Uh, we've got only one. Uh, elite trainer box for the sword and shield set, but we've also got uh, a Grookey starter box. Um, so super excited about that. Uh, we got Egg Soldier and Sweet Slimes. What's up, guys? Uh, Egg Soldier is saying, "What's the date? Uh, is it the eighth? I think it's the eighth today. Yeah, it's the eighth of February. So what's up, guys? How's it going?" So what do you say? Should we get right into this? Um, should we start with the Grookey box or with the Elite Trainer? Um, let's go right into the Elite Trainer box. Let's do it, right? So, how's everybody else doing today? Uh, my mic is over here and I keep trying to talk over here. So, <laughs> um, <clears throat> really excited about uh, this new set. I'm hoping we pull something good uh so the elite trainer box comes with that same player's guide with all the cards in it i'm not going to look through it because i don't i want everything to be a surprise so let's go ahead and look at that box it's not bad it's kind of a cool looking box we'll have to add that to the to the background here we'll have to replace uh maybe a hidden fates box or something um I got shiny G-Max uh, Charizard yesterday. Way to go, Egg Soldier. Nice job. That's awesome. You're going to love that Pokemon. Uh, Sweet Slime says I should open up Grookey first, actually. All right. I mean, I could do that. Um, and Blue Jay, what's up, Blue Jay? Welcome to the stream. Okay, since, um, since somebody did say they wanted to see something else, we're going to do Grookey first because Sweet Slime said Gro Grookey. So, uh, let's see here. Let's see if I can get this in the picture. Uh, we've got this little pin here. Uh, let me... Look at that. Look at that little pin. Look at that cute little grookey. That's pretty sweet. And then we've got the, uh, the starter promos. Uh, so, nice to collect those. So, let's open it up here. How's everybody else doing today? What are you guys up to on this wonderful Saturday? Um, so we've got... Let's get these starters out here. <clears throat> I love that they're doing it better this way, you know? I used to, like, hate to have to pull them off. Um, all right, here you go. First code card for you guys. There you go. We'll be rocking some code cards, so if you guys do the online game, look at that Grookey. And he's got the uh, promo star, while the other two do not. <clears throat> and I think I opened a Sobble box once, um, like the first day they came out, I think I bought a Sobble box. <clears throat> so, um... You also got Egg Soldier. Also got a shiny G Max Tox effect or uh, Tox Tox Toxtricity. Gosh, every time I say Tox, I think about Toxapex. All right, check out the Zamazenta. That is pretty cool. Uh, we'll add that right up to our big card collection, and we've got some older packs to open up before we get into the new ones. Here's just uh, one more look at that pin. Uh, now I've got, yep, I did open up a Sobble box. Now I've got the Sobble and the Grookey. Little surprised Sobble. Um, yeah, that's pretty awesome that you got that, uh, shiny Tox, that Toxtricity, that's pretty sweet. So we've got some Cosmic Eclipse here, guys. We're gonna open this up first. And then we're gonna hop back into some shiny hunting after we're done with cards. Uh, we are going to be going after, uh, we're going to keep going after Aracuda. Uh, for those of you who were here the other night uh, and were following along, 
we are at 301 encounters because uh, Blue Jay and DJ were having a psychic off um, to see who was the better psychic, and it didn't work out for either of them. All right, we got a reverse Curlia. And all right. All right. First pack, you guys. First pack, we pull uh, Tag Team GX. We've got Mega Lopany and Jigglypuff. All right. You guys, it's going to be a good day for pulls. It's going to be a good day. Look at that. That's nice. All right, we'll slip that right there. All right, there we go. First one. Um, what do we got? Now we need Score Bunny. Yeah, we'll grab a Score Bunny when it when I find it. Um, GameStop didn't have it. Um, what do we got? Had to do something. Yay. <laughs> uh, yeah, so we'll keep the Cosmic Eclipse going. Megalopony. Awesome. I'm super happy about that. I love Megalopony. Um, are you guys doing the Google vote for the top Pokemon of each generation? Google has some kind of a, uh, a vote going on so that you can uh, vote for the best Pokemon of each region. And I have been voting for Lopany. Um because I love Megalopony. Look at that lantern. And we've got a Meg Cargo on the on the bat end. So alright, so we got uh sleeping tepig there. Alright. Nothing in that pack. <clears throat> Let's go unbroken bonds. Let's bro go unbroken bonds. <clears throat> Can I have a regular mimic you? No, but how do you how do I do it? What did I ask? I don't even remember what I asked. All right, so code card for you guys for the online. Uh, can you have a regular Mimikyu? If I have a regular Mimikyu, I'll trade you one. Um, we got Tentacruel, Ultra Forest. We got a Dusk Stone, Goldeen, Darmaka. Ooh, we'll, you know we'll see some Galarian forms here when we start opening up our next box. Ultra Forest, and just a Marowak about to get uh, attacked by Team Rocket. That's terribly sad. Terribly, terribly sad. Um, the Google thing. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Thanks, Sweet Slimes. I appreciate that. Uh, the Google thing, if you just go to Google and type in Pokemon of the Year, uh, it'll come up and let you vote on all eight regions. It'll say, like, best Pokemon of each region. And you can vote once a day. I think I voted a few times. You know, we had to, when it came to Hoenn, we had to go for uh, my boy Rayquaza. So that was, that's what we went with on Hoenn. You know, I had to, uh, oh no, I messed it up. I messed it up. Um, this is not the same. I don't know if I did this right. We got a Slowbro Spirit Link. The old school Pokedex, and it's got a Doug Trio in there. Can you see that? It's got Doug Trio up on the screen. That's kind of cool. Haunter, Rattata, Caterpie, Magnemite, Voltorb, Sandshrew, Reverse Metapod, and a Starmie. I have the worst luck with um, with evolutions. Just the worst luck. So let's take a look at you know they always do like some artwork on these elite trainer boxes things. So we've got, uh, can you guys see that? I'll try and do it up here. So there's a Zacian artwork. There's a Zamazenta. We've got a G-Max Lapras and a G-Max Snorlax who's very angry. Somebody probably tried to build a house on his mini belly world, so you know. That would, you know, when you're building a foundation and trying to drill into his stomach, probably not the best for his his nap. Um, let's see here. I will try and shiny hunt Mimikyu. Okay. Yeah, I'll get you a Mimikyu if you're trying to shiny hunt. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure I have one. I'm not sure. And we've got Golden Gamer. What's up, Golden Gamer? Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the chat. We are just opening up some Pokemon cards today. 
So we've got the new set. Here it is. We've got the new set of Sword and Shield. Look at all those packs. All that potential. All that GX. No, it's not GX. What is it? It's V. V. Is it VX? All that V potential. Uh, we've got a... Uh, okay, we've got an empty bag. This uh, was supposed to contain my dice. Um, it just uh, it ripped open. So some really plain, some really plain looking dice this time around. You know the dice is actually always kind of cool, but it's just red. It's kind of boring. I mean this one's alright. It's got some like sparkle I guess to it, but um, kind of some disappointing dice. Um, we got our regular counters things that come with it. We've got some sleeves to put all of our uh, VX into. The arbitrary packet of energy. And oh yeah, of course, yeah, new energies. Okay, we've got new energies, guys. I mean, at least this is the one and only time you can be sort of excited about energies. Uh, we've got the dividers here with Zacian on both sides. Zamazenta getting no love. Well, I guess I bought a Zacian box. <coughs> um, let's see here. We've got... How am I, Golden Gamer? I'm good. I'm good. How are you? How are you doing today? Um, and then Gear Knight did not expect this. Um, we do some random... We do some Pokemon card openings every now and then. Uh, do some Pokemon card openings. We've got the code card for the box, you guys. If you guys are doing the online game, of course. So we got that. I do I, I do open cards every now and then. If you haven't checked out my videos, you know, I've got a lot of vi uh, pack opening videos as well. Uh, does you opening cards mean we are rematching on Monday? Well, after we're done opening cards, we're hopping into the game. We're going to hop into the game after, after we open up cards. So let's get into this new set. Uh, you know, we had to open up cards because the new set of Sword and Shield cards came out yesterday. So these are these are all new for me. First time seeing them. We're going to have to figure out if this is a flip or a pull. I'm going to say it's a pull. Oh, look at that. Look at that guest luck. So there's the Sword and Shield. Uh, I'm assuming that they're going to stay with the same formula. Yep, they are. So we've got the new energies. I kind of like them. I like them way better than the old ones. That's I like that. That's way better. That's nice. Okay. So it's our first Sword and Shield pack. We've got Metal Saucer. Uh, we've got a Quick Ball. Uh, Mantine. we got a Rhyhorn looking pretty fierce. A little Minchino playing with some water. Chinchow. Ooh, that Krogunk's looking kind of evil. I like it. I like it. We've got first Galarian Pokemon. we got Galarian Meowth. Nice, and our first uh, reverse is the is the Rhyhorn that we had earlier in the pack, and uh, our first rare is a Cramorant non-hollow. So we've got Cramorant. You know, it'd be really nice. I wish they would just put shiny Pokemon cards into all the packs going forward, so we could just like do some level of shiny hunting every time. Um, let's see here. What happened? I voted on all regions. Uh, that's it. You just vote. It should say that you voted. I thought it was a whole card stream. Also, I have bad news. You will not be seeing Gallade in our rematch today. Oh, no! Gear Knight. Oh, no. So, I take it you lost the, uh, is it the double, double defense? Or is it the elite trainer battle that you lost that's a bummer we got the psychic that kind of looks a little old school i like it um hi. um <clears throat> well no it's not a full card stream uh we'll be streaming for a little while here of course a few hours at, at the minimum so we've got the new switch that seems to come out every season of or every kind of card deck there's always a switch we got ferrothorn Ooh, we got the raboot i'm excited to see the card artwork for the new pokemon there's snome little cute little snome mawile looking evil 
Gossifleur having a wonderful little time floating around. We got Goldeen, uh, Diglett. We got a reverse Doug. Tri oh my God, you guys! Look at that Doug Trio. Look at that other Doug Trio. It's you guys. Look at how terrified that Doug Trio is. It's because somebody just found out that Doug Trio has regular eyes. That is a rare Doug Trio. And on the back, we've got our first Hollow, and it is Sandaconda. Our first rare, our first hollow of the Sword and Shield set. And it is the Sandaconda, probably using Sand Spit. All right, nice. I like it. It's a different type of holographic, this gen, of course, uh, with those like lines through it, if you guys can see that. I don't mind it. Uh, it's probably not my favorite. Uh, what else we got? Mm hmm. Can I get my Zamazenta, Zamazenta back then? Can you get your Zamazenta back? Did you give me a Zamazenta? You didn't give me a Zamazenta. Um, he used Baton Pass set up with Dragapult and led with Galvantula Sticky Web, which would have one shot, but he put a Focus Sash on it. Um, Focus Sash is common on a Galvantula, so you gotta be you gotta be aware of that. If you, if you weren't already. Uh, we'll pull the card off here. Code card for you guys. Uh, we'll go one, two, three to the front. And we got a water energy there. And we'll flip her around. We've got a lucky egg. That's kind of cool. It's kind of cool artwork. I like that. The lucky egg, always an important card or an important item if you're trying to level stuff up. Uh, of course, now we have EXP candies, but Crushing Hammer. We got Salandit, Clobopus. That's uh, it's the new Gen Eight. We got Ghastly, uh, licking some stairs. That's that can't be good for it. Uh, we've got Rookadi. Si oh, that's pretty sweet. Sizzlipede. I like that. He's looking like he's up to no good. Oh, perfect. We got a Reverse Centiscorch. So we pull a rare reverse. I like that. Um, their reverses are... Mm, okay, I just have to get used to them. And we've got Chinchino on the back, a non-hollow rare. I like the Senna Scorch. Uh, what else we got? We got Antoine uh, in the chat. What's up, Antoine? Anyone using the codes? Um, if you grab them, you grab them. If no one else does, then... Uh, they're yours. Also, I don't feel my best today, so if I mess up in our battle, that's why. But don't worry, I'm still okay. All right. Well, I'm sorry, Gear Knight. I hope you feel better. Uh, Blue Jay, it snowed at my house. Blue Jay, it is always snowed at my house. Was it a good snow or a bad snow? Do you like snow? Oh, yeah, Egg Soldier. If only I used Topsy Turvy on Malamar. Oh, Egg Soldier, you gave your Zamazenta to Gear Knight. I gotcha. I gotcha. Yep. If only I used Topsy Turvy on Malamar sooner, I might have won. I EV trained your Zamazenta, by the way. Can I get it back? I, it's got max in both defense and 4 HP. Okay. So, caught up on my chat. <laughs> let's, get a, let's get another pack opening here. Um, so these are, I'm liking this set though. I like the artwork. Uh, I really like the Raboot. The Raboot. Raboot's probably my favorite so far that we've pulled. We've got the Steel Energy. These energies are actually so much better. I like this energy. I like it. We've got um, Air Balloon, uh, a necessity. Awesome. Always a good one to have. A Pal Pad. Uh, I don't know what it is, but I feel like I need one in my life. Uh, Kingler, uh, that guy is looking like he, like, I just want to be his best friend. I'm not sure why. I just, I think I want to be friends with him. Rosalia, she's taking care of her garden. Oh, we've got this, you know, we, they always have these, like, little clay anime, animation ones. Uh, that is pretty cool. I like that. Uh, we've got Krabby. Uh, his, uh, big brother, Kingler, is looking so much better than he is. We've got Galarian, Zigzagoon, uh, Gossifleur again, Vulpix, and we've got a Poltegeist. 
Um, so another Gen 8 uh, non-hollow rare. All right, so we're getting rid of the, the lame packs first, you know, the ones without without anything good. Um, good Snow, okay. Uh, Sweet Slime says I have a lot of Pokemon cards. I uh, I don't have a lot. I, I have a very good amount. I uh, just recently, really, really just recently got back into it, like a few months ago. So I don't have a crazy amount. Um, which G-Max Pokemon should I get? Um, probably Toxtricity, because it just came out. Uh, I know you said you already have one, but go after another one. Uh, we got the code card there for you guys. And we'll go one, two, three to the front, and we'll pull off the Leaf Energy. No, nope, Water Energy. That means we're going to pull uh, a, a Full Art uh, Inteleon. We got BD. BD is the subject of a lot of uh, controversy uh, in some of my past streams. We had some conversations of whether or not people liked B. Ooh, we got Hitmon Lee uh, facing off against Hitmon Chan over there in the distance oh, above the clouds. We've got Rare Candy, always a, a need before this C, this generation. Clobblepuss again. Cottony, uh, a whole row of them. Oh boy, it's our man Choodle. I like it. I like it. That's he's just looking awesome. You guys, Choodle is just the best. I love Choodle. We've got Rhyhorn. Uh, we've got oh, all right. We got our second reverse, second reverse rare Cinderace uh, performing the pyro ball move. And his ability Libero is on the card. That's pretty sweet. That is pretty cool. And on the back we've got. All right, we've got our first V card, everybody. First V card, and it is more Pico. Gen 8, more Pico, of course. Um, all right, I like it. Look at that little more Pico. Um, you know, it's got like a little bit of a raised feel to it. Wow, that's pretty cool. I like it, I like it. Um, you know, I would hope to pull like a Zacian or a Zamazenta and see what they look like on a V card, but... Nice, not bad, not bad, I like it. We'll put this right over here. It's our first V card of, uh, of Gen 8, Sword and Shield. So it's not a VX, it's just a V. What, uh, what am I missing over here? Uh, <clears throat> uh, just talking about Gear Knight's battle. Um, Gear Knight, that's just unfortunate. I know you really wanted to keep Glade. What was the what was the matchup? I mean, was it uh, did you get swept or did you did you put up a good fight? More 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 pico more 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 pico. That's right. Code card for you guys if you're doing the online. Uh, and remember, if you're not grabbing the codes while I'm holding them up, it'll be available on the uh, replay after we're done streaming today. So feel free to watch it back. Grab those codes. Um, <clears throat> so we've got uh, Quillfish, who just, you know, Quillfish gets the short end of the stick. I feel like he's always seen as like an evil, evil fish. Energy Switch, the new, the new Energy Switch, of course. Dotler, um, new Pokemon, love it. Boltoy, uh, dancing up a storm, get it? Dancing up a sandstorm. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please don't leave. Ch Chin Chow. <laughs> um, Krabby. I don't think anyone thinks I'm as funny as I think I am. Like, I, I in my head, I crack myself up all the time. We've got Little Minchino. Okay, there's a double art of Minchino, because we pulled a Minchino earlier. It was playing with the water, if you remember. So this one's like, this must be a trainer's Minchino, because he's got like a plush premiere ball that he can play with. He's got a little bed. Uh, some Voltorb toys, maybe. Or maybe those are Pokeballs and a, Vol and a real Voltorb. Oh, hey, we got a Golarian Ponyta. All right, we got a Reverse Blip Bug. Uh, not bad, not bad. And on the back, we've got... Yo, I just said it. I just said it. I wanted to see a Zamazenta V. Oh, my gosh, you guys. We pull Zamazenta right after I say it. That is sick looking, you guys. Um... So the reason I wanted to see it, I wanted to kind of see the background artwork 
So it really looks like the cards are going to focus on the artwork of the Pokemon this generation and versus the uh, background. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. This is great. Look at that fierce doggo. All right. We've got um, just the regular V. We, we got yet to pull... Hi. We got yet to pull a, uh, a secret or anything like that. So we'll put that right over there. All right, you guys. Pulling some good stuff here. Um, as I said, he managed to baton pass, critical boost, one evasiveness, and two speed to Dragapult. Why did he pass speed to Dragapult? Seems unnecessary. Yay, Vs. Yep, exactly, you guys. I'm super excited. Uh, I'm going to have a small nap until you finish with the cards. All right, that sounds good. We've only got two packs left, Gear Knight, so it'll be like five minutes. <laughs> oh. It's not that long. I only have the one box for today. Um, just wanted to get into some Sword and Shield cards. Code card for you. Just just a few, but uh, we already pulled two of these. There's the Fighting Energy. And uh, oh, we're starting out with a Quillfish again. We've got another Quillfish. Could that mean something good on the back? Wait. Energy Switch again. Dotler again. That was the same three that we started the last one with. Hold on. It so was. Look. Look. It starts the exact same. Are we going to pull another Zamazenta V? Is that totally what's about to happen? We got Goldeen. Whoops, I'll probably center it here. Diglett. Skaroopy, who I don't know if he's about to attack that Diglett or the Diglett scared him. Uh, we've got Hoot Hoot. Um, Score Bunny. All right, we've got the full evolutionary line for Score Bunny, you guys. We've got the reverse double, and on the back we've got another V. We've got Indeedy. Uh, I think that's the female Indeedy, right? I think uh, Down's female, up is male. So, all right, we got another V card. All right, luck is luck's pretty good right now. That is uh, that's pretty good. We've got our third V card. So, so we've gotten four. Four good cards. Um, let's see, your cards are very mad with you. Why are the cards mad with me? Uh, what's up, random? Tricks Drops is in the chat, everybody. How's it going? Where do I live? I live in North Dakota. Uh, North Dakota is the very, very top of the U.S., and it is a desolate Iceland of just terrible cold. I'm just kidding. It's not that bad. Uh, we have a lot of snow, and it's usually very, very cold here. We'll pull the energy off. We got the fire energy. I would love to pull... Um, I don't even know if there is a full art like Cinderace or anything, but I would love to pull a full art Cinderace. Cinderace. We've got an ordinary rod. BD. We got Raboot. Raboot there. Galarian Ponyta. Cottony. Uh, we got another... Oh, we got the... This was the promo version of Score Bunny. So this is the regular card. Uh, we got Silly Cobra. As we pulled, uh, whatever you call it, Sandaconda earlier. Yamper, just a good little boy. We got the reverse of the Galarian Meowth. And for our last pack, we've got... Oh, man, no way. Did I just call that, though? It's not full art, but I totally just called the Cinderace. You guys, that's pretty sweet. Uh, we've got a holographic Cinderace for our final pack. That is pretty cool. I was j literally just saying that I wanted to pull a Cinderace. So that is pretty awesome. Uh, very, very cool. Super excited about that. That's awesome. I'm super excited. Cool. So we got some good cards. I'm excited about it. We, uh, we started off with three V cards. I'm not sure, you know, I'm not sure where the V comes from, uh, but it's it, it it's whatever. So I'll put these over here for now, and uh, let's try and switch this up so we can bring back our game. I'm going to just uh, grab my little light here and put this back on me. 
Um, all right, well, you guys, uh, we had some great pulls over there. So now we're going to get into some shiny hunting on Sword and Shield, or, well, specifically Shield, of course. So, uh, if you guys were out to just check out the cards, I appreciate it. If you want to hang out and watch us uh, do some shiny hunting, excellent. Um, otherwise, uh, I appreciate anybody that stopped by for the cards. So, let's flip over to uh, the game. And uh, let's get this uh, up and going. Turn it back on, of course. I think it's shut off because I obviously wasn't using it. Alright, so we're, we'll get into it here. Um, and also, I got this little dude. You want to see this? I got this little tiny uh, detective Pikachu figure. Um, he's pretty cool. He's going to go right up in our collection. Uh, and he's going to hang out up here. I'm going to make sure I can actually turn my phone back on here. Uh, so we're going to go back after Aracuda. You guys, we're going to go back after Aracuda. Oh, you know what? I got to move, uh, actually I could probably just leave it there. Let me just, uh, move some things around here. Um, are, are you guys doing any shiny hunting today? Anybody going to shiny hunt with me? I think, uh, who was it? Egg? Who asked me for a Mimikyu? Sweet Slimes, was that you? I think you asked me for a Mimikyu. So I think uh, Sweet Slimes is going to do some shiny hunting. There we go. Get all my stuff plugged back in. And I think I'm just going to keep the mic down here instead of remounting it. So if it's too loud, you, wanna, you guys just want to tell me if I'm too loud and I can turn it down. Um, bum, bum, bum. Okay, so what do we got here? Um, let's see. I, what did I miss? Uh, it didn't send me stream notice for str Oh, okay. Um, it didn't send you the notice for the stream. So, I, you know, I've always heard that YouTube has a lot of troubles with their notifications. Um, you know, and I'm, I apologize if you guys don't get notifications when I go live. Um, that's why I made the schedule so that you guys can know for sure exactly when I am live in case notifications don't go out. So if you ever catch that I'm not, uh, that you're not getting the notification, I'll be on every Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday at 6 p.m. Central and every Saturday at noon. Um, I was like 10 minutes late today just because I was trying to get everything set up for the cards. <laughs> Takes me like an extra few minutes just to make sure I have everything um, on the phone right so I'm not getting like notifications and everything. Um, <clears throat> Kier Knight wanted to have a nap instead of see cards. Cards are very mad with Kier Knight. Oh, okay, I gotcha, I gotcha. I don't know, it, it, it totally is fine if people don't want to see me open cards. It's the same where people take off after I'm done opening cards because, um, you know, they might not want to see me open or do shiny hunting or watch the game. They might be more into cards. So a lot of people stop by for different stuff. I'm okay with either of it. Um, that's why I do both on my channel because I know it appeals to a, a wider crowd. Um, and I enjoy both. I really like opening cards. It's kind of fun. And I also really like uh, shiny hunting on the game. So uh, let's see here. Egg, I have a small headache. Okay, well, I hope you feel better. Oh, yeah, Gear Knight already told us at the beginning that he wasn't feeling the best, or that they weren't feeling the best. Oh, get away. What, where am I here? Turn on my controller. Uh, don't get attacked. What was I doing? I don't remember. I was. I haven't played, actually, for, like, two days. Um, <clears throat> I challenge you to a Pokemon battle. I looked you in the eyes, so you can't deny it. You looked me in the eyes? Um... My eggs for Lucario is 2,283. Blue Jay, you've got 2,283 eggs for Lucario. Blue Jay, do you want a shiny Lucario? I'll give you one. That's that's brutal on 2,283. I will give you a uh, <clears throat> I'll give you a shiny Lucario if you want. Um, let's see. 
I'm gonna hunt tomorrow. I can't have no shiny charm. Um, Random, why can't you have the shiny charm? I got the G Max Tox in Den. Please join. Code is seventy seven eighty eight. Um, hold on. Is it a shiny? I haven't done any. I didn't play at all yesterday, and I played like maybe for an hour on. Uh, um, I played for like an hour the other day, on Thursday. Uh, you for real? Yeah, I'm for real, Blue Jay. Yeah, if you want one, I'll give you one. I think I have an extra, so. If you want a shiny Lucario, I'll give you one. I think it's right over here, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. If you want this, it's yours. I'm gonna, I'm gonna help you out. Nobody wants to go through 3,000 eggs to get a shiny. That's, that's brutal. Brutal, brutal. And we've got uh, Cameron... What's up, Cameron? Um, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. <clears throat> um, not shiny. Uh, I'll probably pass. We're gonna jump over to that Aracuda battle or uh, spot so we can do some shiny hunting. You guys, is my mic? So I have my mic off of the stand. I usually have it like up here, and now it's down here. Is it too loud, or is it is the volume okay? You guys let me know. Um, so let's get into some Aracuda hunting. And uh, Blue Jay, you just let me know when you're available. We'll jump into a trade. I'll give you a shiny Lucario. I'm going to hook you up. That's what that's what Shiny Shuriken is here for. Shiny Shuriken is here to help the world get shinies. That's uh, everything that I wanted this, this to be when I started this. Um, so let's go and let's get our Pokedex ready so we know we're on the Aracuda. So let's go Aracuda. Um, I on Thursday I did do some Hitmonchan hunting. I maybe got like 150 or so, um, but uh, no luck, no shiny, no shiny Hitmonchan. So I'm not gonna. I don't think I'm gonna have that for the battle. Um, we're at 302. 302. Oh yeah, one ran into me like right after I hopped off the stream. It wasn't shiny. Um, the volume is fine. Perfect. Blue Jay, you let me know. Gear Knight, are we going to rematch now or later? Uh, same as usual. Let me do a little bit of shiny hunting first. And uh, and we'll get into it, okay? <clears throat> we're going we're gonna to try and get 100 encounters on the Aracuda. And then we'll hop into our rematch. Um... You can tell I was doing some shiny hunting. I'm down on my moves for Glade, but that's all right. Um, yeah, but we'll hook you up, Blue Jay. Um, I, I understand the struggles, and if you don't mind uh, me be the me being the original trainer on it, then um, absolutely I will uh, get you that shiny Lucario. Because it's it's always tough when you're stuck in a shiny hunt for so long. You know um, that that really does put a damper on your shiny hunting and kind of kills the morale for, for shiny hunting. And um, if you're all good with me being the original trainer, then uh, yeah, we'll do it. We'll do it up. Well, I appreciate everybody that stopped by for, for the card openings. Um, I hope everybody enjoyed it. We got some good stuff. I'm excited. I have to uh, find pages in my book now so I can put the sword and shield cards in. And get that collection started. We're going to buy some more Elite Trainer Boxes here in the coming weeks. For sure. Uh, <clears throat> and we'll open some more cards. I don't think I'll ever do like a full stream where it's just dedicated to just that. So we'll, uh, we'll make sure that... You know what? I should probably change the title now uh, on my stream. Nah, I'll leave it. I'll leave it. Um, because when I save, when it uploads, uh, you know, we'll, uh, we'll let people watch the card opening at the beginning. That way they don't have to scroll through. ABC Gaming, what's up? What's up, Stacy? Welcome to the stream. Um, I just got your messages. Sorry, uh, I turned my phone off while I use it to open cards. Um, 
Okay. All right. Sounds good, Stacy. Uh, yeah. Let's let's try that later. Um, I still 100% want to get into that. Um, there's a lot of stuff on those uh, power rankings that we have to uh, kind of discuss first because some of the stats are off, and we got to figure out how we're going to do that and how we're going to approach that. I need to sneeze. So we're still going to do this Aracuda, you guys. So uh, we're over 300, right? We're over 300. <clears throat> and um, that means we have the four times... Yeah, the, we have the four times multiplier on our shiny odds. So, you guys, this is going to show up real soon. Real soon. We're going to get our little blue fish or purple fish. I can't remember what color it, color it is. But I got some coffee and some water. The necessities of life. I've got my desk is a little bit of a mess. So I'm trying to make myself some room here. <clears throat> but let's get this Aracuda. I'm really excited. I think it's going to show up. You know, I, re I just realized that we got to avoid all the Gyarados. All the 8 billion Gyarados. Um, by the way, I have something to ask you. Uh, yeah, no problem, Gear Knight. Ask away. Make, you know, uh, I'll try and answer anything I can. Um, Stacy, I was thinking as well we should add a standings tab to the dock. Absolutely. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. I got a lot of work to do on that, uh, on that document tonight. So, I, I know that, uh, it's a little bit behind. I've been kind of slacking on updating for the league. But, I'm super excited. We got a, a new, uh... A new member in the league um, taking over our team, so super excited about that. Jake, what's up, Jake? Welcome to the chat. Welcome to the stream. Anyone want to trade a shiny for shiny? Uh, so if anyone wants to trade shinies, uh, hit up Jake in the chat. This Gallade is just rocking these crits. So it's going to crit Aracuda out of the world. Um, so yeah, I'm super excited though because uh, I tried hunting Hitmonchan. I got up to, I got over a hundred, so it means I got the multiplier. So it means that any time that Hitmonchan's out there in the wild, uh, we should be able to hunt it down, and uh, we'll go for multiple actually when I have that opportunity. Looks like Jake's got a lot of hits on that shiny for shiny. Um, so, Gear Knight, that's just a, a bummer. Um, I'm really sorry to hear that you lost Gallade, now that I'm not opening cards. Uh, that's too bad. I uh, <clears throat> I was hoping you'd get that W and we'd have, hear some great stories. But you know what? Um, I understand that those battles can be tough. Um, I think that you uh, are a good battler. I've, I've had some good battles with you here on stream. So, uh, I'm sure you'll get them next time. I wouldn't mind helping you keep it updated. All right, yeah, Stacy, let's talk about that. Um, let's talk about that later. Absolutely, I wouldn't mind the help. <clears throat> it's uh, it's been a lot. <laughs> it's not bad. I mean, creating it took more time than anything else. Just updating it uh, with with streams three nights a week and everything. It's uh, been a lot. Um, let's see here. So, in making a draft league called, uh, you're making a draft league called Monotype Takeover. And you want me to join? It will take place when PWD ends. All right. I'll have to think about it because I I, I was kind of planning on taking a break uh, when PWD. I was kind of thinking about having like a, maybe a month or two in between my draft leagues uh, because we were gonna also start up some other stuff. Uh, I'm right now deleting tons of Pokemon. <laughs> Blue Jay, that mass delete, right? That mass release. We need that. We need that. Uh, um, yeah, I wish, I wish. <laughs> but it doesn't, it's, you know, hopefully you're, you're just hanging out and, uh, we're just gonna hang out, shiny hunt and chat, you and me, while you have to miserably, uh, release those Pokemon. One sec. Okay, had to uh, had to kick the cat out. Cat was going crazy. I feel like that happens. 
Um, but, what was I saying? So, yeah, uh, Blue Jay, hopefully we can entertain you while you have to do the miserable, uh, <laughs> miserable function of releasing. They responded to me with a bot? With a bot? What do you mean? I don't know what you mean. We've had some good matchups happening in the league. Um, week 3 battles are underway. We're going to be jumping into our Week 3 battle, which is what I planned on kind of chatting about on stream here. Just kind of chatting, looking at my opponent's team. It's, uh, it's, quite, the, it's quite the team. We allowed him to pick there. Uh, it's a full rain team. It's kind of ironic because he actually has a Barrascuda on his team. So uh, we got to watch out for that Swift Swim and Propeller Tail. Um, but uh, I'm pretty sure, you know, I'm thinking he's got Rotom Wash, Barrascuda, Seismitoad, Pelipper, Ludicolo. Uh, there's a really core, fit, uh, core five there that he could bring. Um, there might be some switch up. Uh, I know that he, I think he likes bringing Sableye, and uh, I think Eldegoss could could make an appearance. But he he um, drafted a new Pokemon, or he traded for a new Pokemon. Actually, it was our first trade on the league. Uh, he traded for Wobbuffet, so I'm not sure if he'll bring it just yet. But um, it's an interesting option for him. Hi. Uh, when I was asking them to make a multi-select, oh, they responded to you with a bot. I got you. I got you. Um, so yeah, but uh, so his team is um, it's worrisome. It's got some potential. Uh, you know, I'm not sure if bringing weather is my best option um, to this match. You know, I could bring Hippowdon and, and Excadrill. I think Excadrill. Is a great Pokemon, and I did draft it number one overall. But I'm not sure if he'll he'll show up every single week. Uh, we didn't bring him last week, and we got the win. Um, you know, Drake is all, seems like an easy bring uh, for this matchup. Vile Plume as well. You know, so we'll have to look at what he's got to deal with with those Pokemon. Um, obviously, Seismitoad with uh, with his ground typing and um, Swift Swim ability, you could you could really bring um, a, a Swift Swimming Seismitoad uh, and uh, s really outspeed my Dracozolt and take it out with an EQ. Um, so we might we might have to look at maybe what kind of builds we need to live an EQ from some common Seismitoads. So that's kind of one thing to be be aware of. Um, you know, it'll it'll of course be very important to keep uh, Drake as old, um, What do you call it? Healthy. <laughs> it'll be important to keep it healthy. Uh, so we'll try to we'll try to figure out how we keep longevity on Drake as old as much as possible. Um, you know, we could bring some wish passing with Umbreon, of course, and, and provide that support to Drake Azult, but that's, again, always contingent on bringing Drake Azult in on a hit to be able to take that, or figuring out where we're going to get a switch off, uh, and thinking that he's going to allow me that. Um, I think I have more respect for Michael than that, to think that he'll let me get off some cliche stuff like that, so. But we'll, we'll we have to take a closer look at that. i got to start prepping tonight, um, so our matchup is tomorrow. Um, just because he's got a crazy work schedule, he works all sorts of hours, and um, that's okay though. I'm really hoping that nothing goes to timer. Um, you know, we're we're still toying around with the timer stuff. Uh, it's absolutely the worst uh, part of the league, I would say. Is is the timer issues? We've had a lot of stuff going to timer. A lot of people having to figure out like what their um, what their KOs are, you know, because if you still have four Pokemon and you're at timer, but your opponent thinks they were going to win, you have to figure out, like, who KOs what and how that match would have ended. Um, and that's just unfortunate. You know, it's not fun to have to make up stats. It'd be nicer just to play out the battle and see how it goes. So, but um, I'm excited. I'm excited for the matchup. Um... We've played well the first two weeks. We've made some good movement uh, in the league. Um, 
You know, we went up against Sonny in the first week and Jordan in the second week. Jordan had a really good team with Mimikyu and Toxapex. Um, so, Sweet Slimes, can I get the Mimikyu? Yeah, yep, I forgot. I apologize. Let me get that for you. I might only have, I think I only have like a 4-in-1 that I got from a trade, from a surprise trade. I'll have to check. See what I have. Um, let's see here. Let's get my Pokemon on first. Make sure I have a Mim Mimikyu. I'm pretty sure I do. I'm pretty sure I have one like in my breed box. Oh, <clears throat> I'm always getting ahead of myself. I was so lucky when I battled Michael. We got it back um, ASAP. Huh? You got what back? Uh, you still thinking about the restaurant that we're gonna make? Oh yeah, what was the name of that? What was the name of that restaurant, Blue Jay? I don't remember. Yeah, I have Mimikyu's. I figured I did. Mine went to timer this week as well, uh, but it was pretty clear I had it. Yeah, it's, um, it's, like, I think that we have to just, like, you know, of course, come to an agreement and, and really just kind of understand that if it goes a timer, like, talk through it and figure out, like, all right, was it legitimately going to go one way or the other? And, and I, you know, for the most part, I think we're good on that. Um, understandably, everybody thinks that they have a, a good positioning, and so they want to talk through where their strategy was at. But, you know, I went to timer with, uh, what, five, five battles? No, four out of five battles I've gone to timer. And, um, hey, uh, Sweet Slimes, I'm going to do 0425 for the code. So if you want to plug that in, we'll connect and I'll get you this Mimikyu. And it's just talking through, like, how the, how the matchup was going to go. Um... Oh wait, this is a Link Battle. Man. I just don't know what I'm doing here. I'm talking through too much stuff. Uh, no, I don't want to run. Let's fight it at least. But, um, Sweet Slimes, I'll still put up 0425 for that, for that code, so. No, no, I'm sorry. I, I, I clicked Link Battle instead of Link Trade out of habit. And I can't ever think about what buttons to click. Set the link code. Man. All the struggles. Um, what I was saying, though, is that, like, just talking through it, um, you know, I met up with my competitors that those weeks and said, you know, I think this is how it was going to go. Um, you know, you talk through the hits and the options that they had and what you had and just kind of figure that out. Most people, though, the only thing that's been annoying me with the league is that people aren't working through their timers and figuring out where the KOs were going to go. Like, that's important and we need to do that because we need to know, like, what the 6v6 was. Um, otherwise, it just looks like you had, like, a 6-0 sweep in the potential um, matchup, so... Everybody leave me alone. I'm waiting to trade. Get out here, Bear Scooter. I just, you know, it was set at the beginning of the season um, to do that. And <laughs> I don't know why people still aren't. So this is a pretty good one. Um, you've got the Adamant Nature. It's decent stats. So, and it's a Japanese one. So you can breed it with your English dittos if you have a good IV ditto. So we'll trade you that one. And then good luck on your breeding. Um, whatever. It doesn't matter. You don't gotta trade me anything specific. It's just a random mimic you. Um why? Why do you want to trade me a shiny El Creamy? <laughs> um, 
Are you sure? <laughs> you don't gotta give me a shiny. It's just a random level one Mimikyu. Okay, there you go. You don't gotta trade me that. Just trade me some garbage. That's fine. I appreciate the offer. I appreciate the offer, but it's not necessary. You guys don't always gotta give me shinies. I'm just here to help you guys out. If I can. <laughs> Obviously, I don't have a lot of stuff that some people need. Um, Random, are you still in the chat? You know, I haven't asked you recently, and I know you made a comment about it earlier. How's your Pokedex coming? How is that coming? I know you had a long ways to go. I hope you are... I hope you're getting it. Because that Shiny Charm is, is great. Um... You know, we're going to get this Aracuda, and it's definitely going to be because of the Shiny Charm. Oops, I didn't receive the lead card. That's all right. All right, so we traded with, uh, we traded with Sweet Slimes. Uh, Blue Jay, whenever you want to hop into that trade and get that Shiny Lucario, you just let me know. No problem, Sweet Slimes. Like I said, if I can, I'll help you guys out with whatever I can. That's what I'm here for. I'm pretty excited, though, that we pulled a Zamazenta. That's pretty sweet. I'm pretty excited about that one. Pretty cool card. I'm not sure I'm the biggest fan of the Vs versus the GX. I feel like the V takes up too much of the card. <clears throat> but so uh, anyway I was talking about my draft battles and um, definitely Michael's going to be a good matchup but I think I've got a couple of ideas you know, obviously I've got some great recovery options in my Pokemon um, time for shiny hunting and Blue Jay is halfway done with halfway done deleting so good job Blue Jay um, I think I've got some opportunity with a lot of recovery Pokemon, so I don't, <laughs> I'm not saying that I want to run a stall set, but I mean, I think a lot of his Pokemon are, you know, kind of wall breaker potential, like Barrascuda, um, Seismitoad, even Ludicolo, all of them really are kind of set up to be the speed boosted wall breakers, um. You know, max special attack on Ludicolo, max attack on probably um, Barrascuda. So, I mean, lots of lots of stuff you can do with <clears throat> those various sets. Rotom Wash and Pelipper, of course, will be kind of tough to take down. I mean, Pelipper's not really that hard to take down, but um, it's usually built pretty defensively, so it has some longevity to continue to set the ring. And then, of course, Dynamax um, Rain being one of the easiest ones to set if you have water types, of course, because uh, you'll be able to fire off that Max Geyser and get that Rain set back up. So we'll have to we'll have to make sure we're controlling. Um, we'll have to make sure we're controlling the weather. What Pokemon do I put in front? What do you mean? Put in front? Put in front of what? Your party? I use Colossal to hatch eggs with a uh, flame body <coughs> if that's what you're asking uh, you need flame body to hatch eggs fast but uh, Rotom Wash is all, uh, obviously kind of a pest um, good Pokemon it's obviously why it's a number one draft pick went in round one uh, it's not surprising to see it go that fast. It's a, it's a strong Pokemon. It's got a lot of potential. You could do a lot of things with it. You could put Choice Specs on it. You could put uh, Choice Scarf on it. You could use Trick. Put the Scarf on something that doesn't like it. Um, so there's a lot of options of what you can do with Rotom Wash. And um, obviously it can fire off a lot of good uh, moves. You can run Hydro Pump, Thunderbolt, um, and then uh, the momentum ability of it with uh, Volt Switch. So... We'll have to make sure we're paying close attention to that. Make sure that we're uh, not just falling victim to a lot of switch arounds and stuff. So, 
But my team, um, there's not too much t that's built that is weak to water. I mean, obviously Hippowdon and um, Excadrill to an extent. But uh, I've got Vileplume, Umbreon, uh, Reuniclus, Elcreamy. They handle it just fine. Um, obviously Vileplume handles it very well and resists. But yeah, we'll see what we can do. I'm not sure exactly which six that I'm going to bring just yet. So, you know, one thing about having my mic down here, I feel like I'm, like, talking really low. Because I'm kind of keeping an eye on my mic volume levels. <laughs> and it's, uh, <clears throat> it's pretty high, even though it's, like, talking very low. So if we do get this Aracuda, I'll try to, uh, I'll try my best to remember to, like, fly away from the mic. <laughs> um, I don't want to burn out your guys' eardrums. You don't have a Pokemon with Flame Body? Just go catch a Roly Coley. Um, you'll uh, you should be able to find a Flame Body Roly Coley pretty easily. Senna Scorch also has uh, Flame Body as well. <clears throat> so you can hatch with either Senna Scorch, uh, Colossal, who else? I don't remember. A lot of Pokemon get Flame Body, so. I wish the Pokedex had more functionality that you could, like, search more stuff with it. Search out, like, what possible abilities there were. Uh, in our battle, can you bring Pokemon I have battled before so I can work on counters instead of fighting unexpected Pokemon? Sure. Yeah, that's fine. <coughs> I will bring Frostmoth, you guys, because the Frostmoth strategy is amazing. If you guys haven't um, heard about the Frostmoth strategy, we've got Epic in the chat. Hello. Hello, hello. How's it going, Epic? Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the chat. Nice to have you. We're shiny hunting some Aracuda. Uh, if you guys haven't heard the Frostmoth strategy, it's pretty fire. So here's what I do. Okay, if you want to use Frostmoth like I do, because it wins battles, I'm telling you right now, it wins battles. Here's what you do. You send it out, and um, it just dies. That's it. That's the strategy. That's the strategy. Not good. <laughs> it's not a good strategy. Yeah, um, I've heard that before. But uh, in the very last battle that I did that strategy, um, I did win. I saw a video of this guy being super calm when he gets a shiny, and it was really funny, but most of it was fake. I forgot the video's name. I saw um, somebody got, like, I think they got, like, a uh, sponsorship from a company, and they did, like, a video to announce the sponsorship. <clears throat> and they said, like, okay, if I get back-to-back-to-back-to-back-to-back shinies, um, such-and-such such company will... Um... So, okay. Um, so this is a little tough, but, uh... You guys, I'm really sorry about this, but I kind of have to end the stream right now. Um, a little family emergency just came up. So I have to hop off and take care of that. Um, I'm really sorry about that. That's uh, kind of a bummer. Um, we've only been on for like an hour. Um, but uh, Gear Knight, I'm sorry we won't be able to get into our battle. But uh, yeah, there's just something I got to jump off and I got to take care of. So I'm going to have to cut the stream short, you guys. Um, if I can, I'll jump back on later. I'm really, really sorry about this. Um, but family emergency. So um, thank you guys for coming out. Remember, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. And um, we'll, try, we'll try to hop on again later, depending on how this goes. So I'm really, really sorry about this, guys. But I do have to take off. So thank you guys very much for coming out and hanging out with me for the hour. Uh, I appreciate it. And I'll, I'll catch you next time. See ya.